generally speaking, the Indonesian clients are behind in the technology adoption, right? That is uh, normal in the last couple of decades already. And given that the building automation are fairly interconnected technology among different player, different system, and platform operating system, so as a result, the international client who has a platform already built in, it's much easier to build uh, interconnectivities. Uh, between the security, between the automation, uh, between the HVAC uh, and electrical system, for example, right? So I do not expect the Indonesian companies to to leapfrog any foreign player anytime soon. Here we have to have a, a, a holistic approach. Addressing any particular segment itself, uh, not necessarily uh, the most efficient way, so they understand um, how to install efficiently, how to operate and maintain those technology in the most cost-efficient way. You have to educate and uh, continuously uh, explaining to the owner the benefit and return on the investment of those uh, building automation in such a way that um, they, they are able to understand, willing to invest, number one, understand the benefit, as well as reap the benefit of the return on the investment overall. I see that the, the, with the limited space of uh, area for new building, in Jakarta especially, they, they try to compete against each other in terms of uh, to do much more modernization, one versus the others, and so that make it more appealing for the new uh, tenant of, of that building, for example, creating a brand image and perception. Although current trend seems to be a bit slow to pick up here in Indonesia, especially in Jakarta. When I say about Indonesia, mostly happening in Jakarta. I do believe though, however, the trend are picking up, uh, perhaps in the near term, where an old uh, building need to be refurbished um, and they, they, they are more knowledgeable about uh, building automation and so forth, uh, the benefit of modernization, uh, safe on the maintenance and the, the appeal of that building. If I take a look at the trend, uh, if I take, take a look at the cost structure, of building automation system, hardware and software are the biggest component of it, right? And then the, um, the maintenance and next are labor. The labor are dropping uh, as compared to hardware and software, it's true, uh, a small component. But the hardware and software are still uh, a major component and given the current economic situation where the exchange rate of the dollar strengthening I have not seen this trend yet in Indonesia. I hope this will, uh, will change, but however, um, at the current economic situation, perhaps it, it will not be decreasing or even increasing in the, in, in the near future. I've heard several comments from a big player here in the region, uh, in, in, in the city especially, saying that they, they have not been able to reward the, the true benefit of building automation. Um, most of the building automation are still traditional uh, advanced HVAC, uh, cost saving on electricity, but has not really taken into account holistic view approach in the building. How do we connect uh, the security system with the elevator system, with the HVAC system, with the electrical system, security and so forth in such a way that the coordination and interconnectedness is much more seamless. And I believe the technology still have uh, some way to go in terms of the compatibility among different player and technology platform. Therefore, I think it, it is somewhat a challenge in terms of putting those uh, together, so realizing the true benefit of building automation. As you know, Jakarta is growing very rapidly. So the amount of land available over here is, uh, is really uh, constrained with the development of building and population in the city. 
And Jakarta is one of the oldest city in, in Indonesia. Therefore, there's a lot of old buildings that need to be retrofitted. Therefore, there's a lot of competition among one building to the next to differentiate themselves, to make it more attractive, uh, create a brand image and perception in, uh, in the eye of the tenant as well as the customer coming in. So, uh, BASS, B, uh, building automation is one of the way to make it more, uh, more modern uh, and then more appealing um, uh, in, the, in here. Um, so I, I, do, I do see that uh, the trend will continue um, and then especially the new developer coming in um, in, in Jakarta, they want to create um, a new perception and key differentiation using building automation.